This is a poem I've recited for quite a, quite a few years, and it's called How the Great Guest Came. Before the cathedral in grandeur rose, at Engelberg where the Danube flows, before its forest of silver spires went airily up to the clouds and fires, while yet the oak had ready a beam, while yet the arch was stone and dream, there where the altar was later laid, Conrad the cobbler plied his trade. It happened one day at the year's white end, two neighbors called on their longtime friend, and they found his shop so meager and mean, made gay with a hundred boughs of green. And Conrad was sitting with face a shine, but he suddenly stopped as he stitched his twine. Old friends, good news at dawn today, while the cocks were scaring the night away, the Lord appeared in a dream to me and said, I'm coming, your guest to be. So I've been busy with feet astir, stir, strewing the floor with branches of fir. The wall is washed, the shelf is shined, and over the rafters the holly is twined. He comes today, and the table is spread with milk and honey and wheat and bread. His friends went home and his face grew still as he watched for that shattered across his seal. He lived all the moments o'er and o'er how the Lord should enter his lowly door. The knock, the call, the latch pulled up, the lighted face, the offered cup. He would wash the feet where the spikes went in. He would kiss the hands where the nails went in. And then at the last he would sit with him and break the bread while the day grew dim. While Conrad mused there past his pain, a beggar drenched by the driving rain. He called him in from the stony street and gave him shoes for his bruised feet. The beggar went and there came a crone, her face with wrinkles of sorrow sewn, and a bundle of wood bound her back, and she was spent with the rich and the rack. He gave her his loaf and steadied her load. Then she took her way on her weary road. And then to his door came a little child, lost and afraid in the world so wild, in the big dark world catching it up, he gave it the milk in the waiting cup, then led it home to its mother's arms, out of the reach of the world's alarms. The day went down in the crimson west, and with it that hope of that blessed guest, and Conrad sighed as the world turned gray. Why is it, Lord, that your feet delay? Did you forget that this was the day? Then soft into silence a voice he heard, lift up your hearts for I've kept my word. Three times I came to your lowly door, three times my shadow was on your floor. I was the beggar with the bruised feet, I was the woman you gave to eat, and I was the child on the homeless street. <laughs>